Hi, I'm a member of the University of New Haven's Cyber Forensics Research and Education Group, and throughout five videos we'll be showcasing security issues in over a dozen Android apps. The goal of this research is to inform both the user and the developer of these issues. This is day three of five. Today we'll be looking at security issues in Meet Me, Message Me, and Text Me. For the network analysis, we created a test network using Windows 7's virtual mini port adapter. We connected the Android phone to this network, and that allowed us to monitor all traffic being sent and received by the Android phone. An iPad was connected outside the test network and was used to exchange data to the Android device. Okay, so our Android device is connected to the test network, network miners up and running, and our Android device is about to send a message to the iOS device in Meet Me. And once the key phrase Game Boy Color is sent, it is picked up a network miner. And once the message Uncle Tito is received from the iOS device, it is also picked up a network miner unencrypted. Next, we'll be looking at Message Me and the Android device will be sending the key phrase Game Boy Color and once it's sent it is picked up a network miner and once the key phrase Apple Bed is received from the iOS device it is also picked up a network miner next we'll be sending an image to the iOS device and that is instantly picked up a network miner Next we'll be receiving an image from the iOS device and that too is picked up a network miner. Next we'll be sending and receiving a doodle, however only the received doodle was picked up in network miner. Next we'll be sending our location, which is instantly picked up a network miner and then the iOS device will send its location to the Android device and that is also instantly picked up a network miner. Next we're going to open up NetWitness Investigator to examine an audio file that was sent from the Android device to the iOS device. When we click on audio slash mp4 we can see that there is a downloadable audio file. This shows that there are security issues with music files in MessageMe. We recorded network traffic in Wireshark to see if files remained on the server. For MessageMe, we found a video that we sent weeks ago, still on their server, unencrypted and without authentication. Next we'll be looking at TextMe, and we'll have a image being received from the iOS device, and it is picked up in Network Miner. Next, we'll share our location with the iOS device, and it is picked up, and the iOS device then shares its location, and it is also picked up. Then using Helium Backup, Android Backup Extractor, and SQLite Database Browser, we were able to view the TextMe database file, which stored our password in clear text.